Hello student, last class I explained about the digestion in grass eating animals. Okay, so the animals, uh, we learned digestion in humans and animals, but some uh, organisms which do not have mouth and uh, um, stomach, how they will uh, uh, how they will feed and how they will uh, obtain food and how they will uh, digest. Okay, I will explain in this class. Today, our topic and the last topic in this chapter is feeding and digestion in amoeba. So, amoeba. This is the amoeba structure. Okay. So, amoeba structure parts. This is food vacuole. This is food particle. Sorry. So, the nucleus and these are the food vacuole and this is pseudopodium and this is a adjusted waste. Means a unwanted waste. Okay. Unwanted, undigested residue. Adjusted waste means. Okay. So, this is the diagram of amoeba and these are the parts. Understand? So, amoeba is a single-celled microorganism which you can see, in, okay, which you can found in pond water okay, and you can observe under the microscope. Understand? And the amoeba has cell membrane and round and dense nucleus and also small bu bu uh, bubble-like structures which are you can see here, I draw with blue color, is present inside the cytoplasm we called as food vacuum. Okay? So, and, uh, and also amoeba constantly changes its shape and uh, position. That's why, suppose if you've seen like this amoeba, next, next minute it will change to this structure. Afterwards it will change to this structure. So, that's why amoeba, there is no shape. There is no constant shape. Why? Because amoeba constantly changing its shape and uh, position. Understand? So, amoeba is a single cell microorganism you can found in pond water and also has cell membrane, nucleus and also round bubble like many round bubble like structures which we can call the food vacuole which are present in its cytoplasm and it continuously constantly change its position and uh, shape. And also if you observe here, these are the finger like projections, one or more you can observe outside, this we call the pseudopodium or false feet, which we can, uh, which is used for, uh, for movement and uh, to capture the food item. And amoeba also feeds on other microorganisms, okay, when it senses the food, it immediately opens out, okay, Op um, suppose this is the food, okay, so food taking we call the ingestion right so when the food it sends the food it immediately it will open and it uh, the pseudopodia will approach the food item and it will sur around the, okay it will cover the surround of the food item and uh, immediately engulf it means here engulf means completely surround and uh, covered by the that particular covered by that particular uh, uh, a substance so immediately the food item will okay capture inside the food vacuum and here the digestion process will takes place inside the food vacuum so after that uh, it, the food trapped in a food vacuum so digestive juices digestive juices are very very essential to digest okay in digestion process same as humans and animals here also digestive juices secreted into a food vacuum and these digestive juices helps to break down okay the food particle into a simpler substances afterwards gradually this digestive food is absorbed these absorbed substances used for growth maintenance and multiplication of amoeba okay so afterwards what will happen after absorption the undigested residue unwanted residue okay which is uh, mm, come outside okay come outside by the vacuum okay this is the amoeba how feeding under digestion process will take place in detail you will learn in later classes okay later uh, higher classes so this is a brief explanation about the feeding under digestion in amoeba so in this second chapter uh, your second chapter uh, nutrition in animals you learn different ways of food taking food and components of food and uh, digestion in humans digestion in uh, grass eating animals and also microorganism like uh, amoeba okay if you have any doubt you ask through whatsapp thank you